This is what it looks like when Purell gets squirted in the eye. When we check the eyes like this, we're putting a little yellow dye in the eye and we shine a blue light at it. That lets us see where there's indentations and scratches and you can see a huge part of the cornea is just kind of eaten away. They were in a lot of pain, it was really uncomfortable, they were kind of scared because things were blurry. Purell and all those alcohol-based hand sanitizers are usually about pH neutral. So while it does burn the eye and it hurts really bad, it doesn't eat deep into the eye, so it heals relatively quickly. It's still dangerous and you should get yourself checked out, but the main thing to remember with this is if you get Purell in your eye, you want to wash your eye out a lot. Wash your eye out for 15 minutes. She thought at the time that she washed her eyes out really well, but when I looked in her eyes, she still needed to wash her eyes out more, so I did that in the office. Uh, she's doing a lot better now, everything turned out just fine. Um, that was a pretty large, big burn. Um, it must have just got her right in the eye. Some of those hand sanitizers have kind of aloe and other additives to them, so they'll kind of clump up at the tip. So if you put a bunch of force on there, it can kind of shoot up towards your eyes, so be careful about that. Two main takeaways from this. The main one would be don't put hand sanitizer in your eyes. There's better ways to clean them. And the other is if you do get hand sanitizer in your eye, make sure you wash your eye a lot. You can use uh, saline solutions. If you don't have anything around, use water. Just use anything. Get it out of the eyes.